Hello everyone, this is Leslie. Welcome to my channel. Today, I will bring you to visit Victoria and see how in Canada, we practice social distancing. Let's go. So our first stop will be Fairway Market and it welcomes us with this lovely picture. It has a policy, no reusable bags, no bottle deposit, and we have to keep a distance of six feet, which equal to two meters. A few days ago, I see that there's a security guy who actually manage how many people can get in, but I don't see anyone today. In the first area, you will see there's a bakery area and there, there are still tons of bread here. And uh, everywhere you go, you will see uh, some notice that reminds you about keeping social distancing, which is two meters. I see that the organic area is almost out. It seems like organic products are very popular now. You will also see that the employees here, they are wearing masks and wearing gloves as well. Our fairy market is a market for Asia and Western, for Asian and Western products, but um, you will probably see that most of the Asian uh, noodle is al already out, uh, but the pasta is still available. Um, the price is not on sale, but there is still lots of products there. Everything is still there except this thing. This soap is for, it's three in one so you can probably clean your whole body with it um, and in the cashier you will see there's some arrows that uh, direct you where to go uh, and uh, at the cashier they have kind of like a glass that protect the staff here to have a distance with the client our next stop is Walmart uh, so this market is super popular and you see that we actually have to follow a line here that is set up earlier and there are tons of security guys around here, um, at least two here at the gate. Uh, and when you get in there, you will see on my left hand side, there is a gentleman, he cleans up the handle of the trolley. So I think those steps are really uh, important to make sure that we not gonna get um, the virus. And uh, if you keep walking a little bit further, you will, you will see there is a hand sanitizer. I take a little bit. When you walk around, you will see there is some aisle um, with uh, some line here. So make sure that you have a uh, distance between each order. When you walk a little bit further in, um, in, in the middle of some aisle, you will see there is um, papers and uh, some sanitizers, but some, some of them have some not. Some even have gloves, but as I mentioned earlier, they don't keep it consistent. Uh, some aisle, they have it, some not. I bring you to this area. It doesn't really relate it to social distancing, but because I love chips, I love chips. This is my favorite brand, Lace. Now we are in the meat section, and in the meat section, you see that there are still tons of meat here. However, in the beef section, ground beef it's almost empty. Is it popular? Maybe because people want to stock it for pasta sauce, maybe, I guess. And then look at this guys you don't have to fight with each other for paper special toilet paper because in canada we make sure that we keep your butt clean it's a little bit expensive here but they limit uh the number of purchase so i'm thinking if i have two people here can i actually buy two no it's one per transaction it's not one per person so we still have a lot of toilet paper and paper towel here. And similar as Fairway, you will see there are also some line here to get into the cashier. Um, and uh, between those lines, the distance is also about uh, six feet. And uh, it's not crazy crowded here as normal because of course uh, the security guy wants to make sure that it's not overcrowded here. You have to wait for the previous transaction to be finished, then you can um, upload your products you will see that the employees here they're also wearing masks um, and gloves and uh, the glass is a little bit wider with more protection our next stop is Fujia. this is a very popular place in victoria for japanese products they don't have security guy here but they have like this they're just their staff they limit the number of guests 
maximum is just four people in the store because the store is very small so they don't want to have more than four and they actually prepare a wipe tissue here for you to clean your hand before you enter the store uh, and uh, similar as other store they also have those line here it's pretty same uh, with the same length about six feet uh, unfortunately all of my sushi and sashimi are gone they don't do it anymore look at this wow look at this curtain they actually make it a little bit extreme to protect the staff uh, completely away from the customer okay so it looks lovely and very protection our last stop will be thrifty foods so this place is also very popular for organic products and western products um, and uh, at the front gate they have a notice about uh, social distancing it's also about six feet and uh, we also have to line up same as walmart or fujia it took me about 10 minutes to be able to get into the store and there's security man who managed the number of customers to get into the store and at the front you will see there's a ladies um she's there to clean up those public trolley i really appreciate her to do that most of the products are pre-packed and we don't have to touch to those tongs or spoon anymore. It's pretty nice to see that everything is uh, well organized and people um, keep the distance with each other. Um, most of the practice are similar about the line, about at the cashier, uh, and you don't use reusable bag from your own. They provide paper bags for you for free. Uh, usually it's five cents, but now it's for free. Well, yeah, so that is everything for this tour. Please comment below uh, where you're from and how your country practice social distancing. Thank you for watching and I see you next time. Bye bye.